White flag. That off. And the Monkey Communications beginner's chase. Short run to the first of 13 fences. Commanding presence with Indiana Jones, closely followed by Limestone Rock and Jen Wah. Racing on to the second fence. Losing at the first, John Adams. Jeremy's Flame out over the second fence, followed by Indiana Jones. Jen Wah the inside of Limestone Rock and then Farseur de Large. And this leading group of five have raced, and Farseur de Large and Limestone Rock are gone there. And they have, in the process, brought down another as they turn in for the two fences in the straight. Commanding presence, the one that was brought down by the two independent fallers as they level off for the two fences in the straight. Jeremy's flame, <laughs> cleared of that aggravation, leads Indiana Jones and Jen Ward then winging a prayer. Carroll's Cottage, mill into one. Scarpetta in mid-division, blue and white quartered colors of Mr. Incredible. And then El Cora, start cap of Norwegi. And they're followed by Isotope. And Persia, the quartered cap at the back of the field. Indiana Jones has jumped to the front over that fifth fence and races on two and a half in front of Jeremy's Flame. In third is Genwa. These three nicely cleared of Wing and a Prayer. And then Carol's Cottage and Millen to One, Mr. Incredible and Scarpet, and then El Cura with the last three, Norwegi, Isotope, and Persia. Heading out with a circuit to race and another eight fences left to jump. Going to the first of two past the stands. And all riders are up and walking after the fence on the turn into the straight. And two of the rice ho loose horses just running across in front of the path of Indiana Jones. Jeremy's flame second, and then Jen Wah. Food diligence is one I'm also missing from the field. Going now to the 10 furlong point, Indiana Jones with three loose horses ahead. Jeremy's flame within two lengths. In third place is Jen Wah, then wing in a prayer. Millen to one. Mr. Incredible, good jump up on the inside. Heading out now to the next ditch. There's Mercury Lane being pulled up right in front of us. So much has happened in this race. The Mongi Communications beginner's chase, Indiana Jones, with no shortage of loose horses around him. In second place is Jeremy's Flame, Jen Walls in third, then Wing and a Prayer, Millen to One, Mr. Incredible next. On the outside, Carol's Cottage with Scarpetta and El Cora. Isotope next. At the back of the field, Norwegi and Persia. For the time being, the loose horses are out of harm's way with the exception of one who's up with the leaders. At the fifth last fence, and it's Indiana Jones, a good proficient jump, extended the lead over Jeremy's Flame, then Jen Wall, Wing in a Prayer, and Millen to One. Mr. Incredible is starting to gain ground. On the outside is Norwegian, and then Carol's Cottage as they jump four fences from the finish. And the leader is Indiana Jones and Dad O'Keefe by one length to Jeremy's Flame. Keith Donahue's second, four or five lengths back to in third place, Jen Wall and Mark Walsh. As they jump the third last fence on the run back towards the straight. Millen to one is next. On the inside is Mr. Incredible, who's now been wound up to try and close ahead of Wing and a Prayer and El Cora. And they're followed by Norwegi. Turning in, two fences left to jump. In a race full of drama, Indiana Jones from Jeremy's Flame. Gone up to match it as they swing in. Out in front of Jen Ward and Mr. Incredible. Millen to one and El Cora and Wing and a Prayer. Running on is Norwegi ahead of Scarpetta. Carol's Cottage, Isotope, and Persia. That's the lot. Two fences left to jump, and it's Jeremy's Flame out jumped by Indiana Jones. 
who pecked at the back of it. Then Gen 1, Mr. Incredible. El Cour is behind them. And in between the final two fences, in the Monkey Communications Beginner's Chase, the leader is Indiana Jones from Jeremy's Flame. Gen Wall's trying to close. Although it didn't meet that fence on his stride, Mr. Incredible on the far side of El Cura. They're bunching up the hill. Indiana Jones from Gen 1. Mr. Incredible on the far side with Jeremy's Flame. It's Indiana Jones, Mr. Incredible, and Rachel Blackmore is hoovering up a four-timer. Mr. Incredible has run down Indiana Jones. Behind them was Jeremy's flame in Gen 1. El Cora, Mr. Incredible picks up where he left off here in January. Fences in front of him on this occasion.